Zwom. Bemo. Hello, everyone, and welcome to another Bemo Creative video. So, have you ever heard of the game Beagle or Bagel? This is not a commercial for the game, but it is a fun game uh, created by designer Jeremy Posner, published by Blue Orange Games June 18, 2019. And like most things out there in this world, folks, it is for people age seven and up. So all you babies out there, I know, I know, it's not for you, and I am sorry, it is not for you, okay? But it is a family-friendly game and requires two to six players, and it stimulates visual perception basic premise is to flip cards quickly and call out beagle or bagel depending on the one you think has the most on the table. There are three different ways of playing including rules and tokens and treats which are also provided in the game as you can see it's all it's all there for you. So I th I could see how this could go um, kind of bad without a game host maybe to be able to tell which person called it out first because I could see where it would start out pretty calm everybody's friendly and relaxed but then, before you know it, two or three turns in, they're going to be shouting at the host, Bagel! 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 And before you know it, you know, everybody's shouting. And yeah, and then there's the one person who's the sharpest of them, usually, that's not very loud. And so they always don't win. And so they're going to go all vampire on you, even though, yeah, they, they were the winner, but they never get called out to be the winner. So yeah, the host is like, oh, why am I doing this? Why? So yeah, it's, uh, it's lots of fun. Lots of fun. So I thought we would play this game. I'm going to put up images of beagles and bagels. And I'm going to call out beagle or bagel. And if you do it before me, you win. Okay? Ready? Let's do this. Beagle. Beagle. Bagels. Bagel. Beagle. 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 Bagel. Yeah, I could see how this could be confusing at first. I could see how this could be confusing, especially with the dogs that are all curled up like a bagel. It could be really confusing, you know? You, Before you know it, you start eating a, a beagle, thinking it's a bagel. Okay, maybe not this confusing, okay? Maybe not. How about a uh, beagleina bagel? Wow, I called that one. Boy, am I good. I am so good. Look at that. But you know, I put dog or bread on here because I know a lot of people that beagle and bagel would sound the same just because of the way they pronounce their words. They'd be like, bagel, bagel, I said bagel, I said bagel, you know, and you, you, it all sounds the same. So yeah, you'd have to change the name to dog or bread to be able to tell which one they actually said. I don't know. So how about this? Beagle bagel. Yeah, it's a beagle in a bagel. Wow, I called that first. Look at that. So yeah, that's kind of confusing. Or uh. Let's just go to this because it's easier to say. Kitty croissant. Ooh, boom, look at me. Man, I am so good at this. I am so good at this. So, it's a kitty and a croissant. How about a cat eating cakes? And they do do that. Yeah, yeah, cats eat cakes. You didn't know that? Yeah, cats will eat all kinds of stuff. They, they like eating anything that you pretty much leave out. Um, you gotta watch them, you gotta hold them back because they can't help themselves and they get all up in it. Yeah, they'll throw a lot of butter on it and everything and they, they just they just keep going in. So you gotta stop them. I also hear that they, uh, cats like watermelon too. They really indulge themselves in watermelon if you don't stop them. So you gotta keep an eye on cats with watermelon and spaghetti if I'm not mistaken. So yeah, I cropped her face out because I didn't want all you people getting mad at her for feeding her cat spaghetti on purpose but you know what i changed my mind yeah if you guys know her please stop her she is out of control out of control okay ready kitty croissant boom the kitty and the croissant i think it's easier to tell the cats from the croissants compared to the beagles and bagels because cats usually are like eating the croissant or uh you know they have their eyes open you can kind of tell that's not a beagle or a bagel or a croissant. That, that's, a, that's a cat, right? That's a cat rolled over. Okay, so how about this? Chihuahua or muffin? That's hard. They really do look alike, folks. Or these days, Chihuahua, muffin, or iPhone. Look at that. They really look alike. 
Okay, so anyway, back to the game. Beagle, 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 bagel. Okay, so obviously I win. So there you go, everybody. This has been another BMO Creative. And uh, I hope you're enjoying these videos. Go ahead and subscribe. Give a thumbs up and practice. Go ahead and watch this video over again. Practice it. Or, I don't know, buy the game. Maybe that'll help. All right, we'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.